All right, bro, bro, listen to me, listen to me, listen to me, listen to me. You Devil May Cry fans, y'all got, I give y'all mad fucking respect, bro. Mad fucking respect, okay? I love Dante. I've never played the games. So I said this year, we're playing through all the Devil May Cry games. Well, the main series, okay? Yeah. And boy, Devil May Cry 1? Off of that alone, y'all just got my respect, bro. Ooh, let, let's get into this. So the story starts out with Dante just chilling, and then this baddie on a motorcycle comes crashing through and proceeds to stab this man in the chest with his own sword. And then all of a sudden they're cool. So Dante takes his sweet time going through Malay Island and exploring the castle, the garden, underworld, you know, just so he could go and kill this guy Mundus. And that's the story. I'm gonna stop joking. But I can't say much about the story because it is no game and there is not a lot there. But there is a story. There is a story. It's just not a lot to talk about. When it comes to the gameplay for Devil May Cry, this is like the easiest game I've ever played. So, you serious? I got three clips saying otherwise that this game was easy. Let's play it. No, 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 chat, 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 are you on my side or not? Please, 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 please. Uh, oh, uh. I don't know how I was going to dodge that one. Thanks, game. Oh. I have to read. I have to redo the first mission. We also have the platforming that you had to do, Shane. That was pretty easy, right? Right? Remember the platform you had to do? Pretty easy, right? Words were not computing. Words were not computing. Shane.exe has crashed. What the fuck? Thank you. Damn it. I really under jumped it. Some bullshit. Okay, that's some more bullshit. Okay, can we can we not just fucking platform? <laughs> I don't like platforming in this game. Platforming in this game should not be a thing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I, I just don't like it. Fuck his platforming in this game! You better not under jump it, Dante. Thank you. Also, let's not forget about the time that you got lost for about 46 minutes. After you cleared the mission, all you had to do is just jump it in. Am I supposed to hit this shit? Like, what am I? Forty six minutes. Forty six minutes. I know, I know. But can I have my video back now? Can I have my video back? They weren't supposed to see those clips. That's for the people who are in the live stream. Come check me out. 
but let's get back into it. So for the gameplay, I want to split this up into about three parts. First, we have the action with the combos. Then we have the exploration. And then we have the platforming. At the beginning of the game, the combos felt like I was just pressing one button over and over and over again, or just shooting the guns as, as long as the enemies would die. But later on, I started realizing, oh, what if I started timing when I press these buttons and I started doing different combos? And things started making a little bit more sense then I started to learn how to launch them. It was, the combat in the game, if I had to compare it to anything, can't really compare it it feels like its own thing which is which is a great it's a great thing for a game to where it feels like something is theirs okay okay i then gave devil may cry a compliment on their combat which is really good i do i do believe it's good but now it's time to talk about the platforming and i'm gonna keep it short i'm gonna keep it short i feel like for the era that this game came out they should have never added the platforming in it unless they were going to go all in with the platforming. To be honest, it doesn't complement the game. Now let's move on to the exploration. I'm going to keep this one short too, but I will say the maps, they look really good. They're, they're really cool designs, all of that, but they're very empty. If you're not fighting an enemy or something, the maps are just empty not much to do in them but i feel like that's gonna change in the later game so who knows all right so the bosses for devil may cry 1 feel like a game from 2001 2002 which isn't a bad thing the bosses work really well for the game they follow the rules of three where you have to fight the boss three times then it's truly done and the bosses aren't they're not easy i'll say that they're not easy but you do feel like you are learning it and you're getting better each time that you come back and fight it there are some more memorable bosses memorable bosses than others yeah you saw how we had to slow that down keep it all in but yeah there's some more memorable bosses and then there are just some bosses that are like fuck you fuck you and then there's the final boss the final boss Mundus, I'm not gonna lie, the first part, kind of easy. The second part, I was struggling, so I said, fuck it, I'm using items. I started using my holy waters, my untouchables, and I got through it. And then, the plot twist, I, I should have known because you know the rule of threes, I should have known because of the rule of threes. But, I didn't realize that, and... I had to had to fight him one last time in like the underground and that was fucking easy i'm not gonna lie that one easy well then that the bosses were pretty good now the real boss is the camera angle i know i know i look different different time just just listen that camera angle bro that camera angle who thought that was a good idea for an action-packed game like that to have a fixed camera angle, I don't know. And maybe you could say it was just based on the time that the game came out. I don't know. I think there were some other games out at that time that had a you know controllable camera angle. I think it's just because they're trying to you know follow the Resident Evil thing of fixed camera angle or something. It, 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 mm, I don't. Mm, Hopefully in the next game is, is better. Hopefully in the next game is better. Peace. See ya. Um, I just want to say thank you for watching. Goodbye. This was my first time trying a video like this. I hope you enjoy it. Content's always going to get better. Uh, eat some chicken. Have some food. Uh, drink some water. Definitely drink some water. 